Yeah, so basically what today was about was a deep dive into the frontier section of the game. So this is like a hyper-compressed uh, version of the northeast coast of America in the 18th century. And we're showing off all of the new stuff from uh, organic uh, navigation of rocks and cliffs and trees to some of the new animals to some of the new side quest systems and uh, of course a whole bunch of assassination. You can continually hunt, so all of the animal systems are systemic within the world. Uh, you can find them, you can fill out your hunting map and figure out where they are and go and hunt them at any point. And you can trade those in uh, uh, for money at any point if you want. Here is the meat you requested. Thank you. There is also side quests. So what we wanted with the side quest was the ability to uh, accumulate a bunch of tasks on the side while you were in your main quest. So you might eventually get a list of things people want from hunting animals. And then when you get a main quest that takes you to the frontier, it's a perfect time to sort of uh, complete all those at the same time. Yeah, so the forts for us, there's there's uh, uh, several of them in the in the in the different environments. Uh, there's sort of more of the uh, side quest content than the main story, and all of them. Our goal was to make them uh, assailable from different angles, so they have different strategies or, or uh, different multi-path opportunities within them. But each one is still focused around uh, assassinating a Templar. Pretty much every tool in the game is systemic, so it can be used from any branch or any any overhang or any ledge or even on the ground. Uh, so uh, once you've you know unlocked them and uh, and equipped them, yeah, you can you can go nuts. Stick to the woods. The fort is heavily defended, but if you approach silently. You should be able to make short work of them. All weapons are useful as assassination tools, so whether it's the tomahawk uh, or even weapons you pick up, such as the musket, uh, and all of them are also useful for assassinating on the run. So the goal was to make it so that you can uh, run into some unsuspecting guards, pick off a few of them in the run, immediately blend into combat, finish everyone off, and then run out of there as well. Uh, Assassin's Creed 3 is coming out on October 30 on uh, Xbox 360, PS3, and Wii U.